Hello folks, uh, today I'm presenting you uh, our latest model of our commercial steel for extraction of essential oils and this is uh, 280 liters or 74 uh, lit uh, gallons model. Uh, we did quite major changes in the construction in order to make uh, the distiller even more comfortable to, to use for end customer, for the person who will be managing this. Uh, and uh, I think this is really great things uh, we did uh, and I will show you uh, today the distillation process and things we have changed so you will see, let's go! After we filled the distiller with water and connected to the cooling and all the heating just before the starting the distillation uh, we fill uh, the uh, the, the tank with uh, raw material, in our case today it's rosemary and uh, we are putting 20 kilograms of rosemary into the tank actually 25 kilograms of course uh, you should pack as much as possible but for testing purpose uh, 25 kilograms of rosemary will be more than enough we have uh, 80, uh, 75 degrees on the thermometer and uh, uh, we have got uh, first drops of hydrozol in the oil separator around 5-10 uh, minutes ago and we have got already around uh, uh, 150 milliliters of uh, rosemary essential oil distillation is, is going on and I share with you our major changes, what we have done uh, in, in the distiller. Uh, I believe the m one of the most important uh, changes uh, w uh, we did to the distiller is uh, wheels, which enable uh, the distiller to move easily in your space. And another piece is that um, the rack which holds uh, the oil separator is connected to the main frame it doesn't have uh, legs so uh, you don't need to uh, align that, that with uh, the main frame uh, we have changed also the, uh, the frame for the gas burner uh, it has different, totally different construction and uh, using this handle you can press it uh, uh, backwards uh, in order to rotate uh, the, um, uh, the tank and we also add uh, the, um, the defense for the water level so you don't break it and we have changed also the fixation um, tool uh, for the um, um, when you rotate uh, the the tank to fix it uh, in hor horizontal position uh, it was on the thread and now it's uh, you just uh, put it in and it's fixed uh, and there were some other changes which made uh, the distiller much more comfortable to use and I'm sure you will uh, enjoy the process when you just try it so we have got around uh, 230 milliliters of uh, rosemary essential oil. Uh, it took uh, around one hour from the um, point of uh, boiling. Uh, if uh, you fill up the, the tank uh, fully with raw material, of course, within this period of time you will get much more essential oil. And uh, one of our major changes as well uh, of the distiller is the changes we have de uh, we did to the essential oil separator. So it has uh, two modes. Uh, this uh, regular mode uh, where you collect the essential oil in the uh, separator. You see uh, it is uh, there on the top of, of the hydrozol. And when we open this tap, uh, the oil will be reaching this level and will be pressed into this uh, lower tube and we collect it into the glass jar. So we open and see how it happens. Uh, 
the hydrosol stops uh, running because uh, and now it's collected into the uh, separator and it will continue running when when the oil will reach the top of this tube so let's wait for a while so the oil reaching the top of the upper tube and now it will start running the hydrosol has started running and the oil as well on this end you will get pure essential oil And we will observe when uh, the hydrosol will reach very top of this uh, uh, upper tube. And now you can stop the collecting oil. So we have got uh, 230 milliliters of rosemary essential oil out of uh, 25 kilograms of rosemary, dry rosemary. It seems it was not that good, uh, that good quality, so the yield is uh, below 1%. Uh, and uh, I'm sure you will enjoy using this distiller and we will think further to make it even more comfortable more comfortable for use if you have any questions regarding commercial distillers or smaller ones please do not hesitate to contact us and we will be happy to guide you on all your queries thank you